Tropical, tropical cyclone warning issued at 4.15 by the Royal Observatory. The strong wind signal number three is hoisted. This means that winds with mean speeds of 41 to 62 kilometers per hour are expected. At 4 o'clock, Typhoon Helen was centered about 170 kilometers southwest of Hong Kong and is forecast to move west-northwest at about 8 kilometers per hour towards the southwestern coast of Guangdong. During the afternoon, Ellen continued to move away from Hong Kong in a west-northwesterly track. If it keeps on with this course, it will make landfall over western Guangdong tomorrow morning. Due to the slow movement of Ellen, local winds will remain strong overnight. Another surge of the northeast monsoon is also expected to reach the South China coastal areas tonight, keeping our winds fresh to strong tomorrow. You are asked to listen to your radio or watch television for further weather broadcast. You should not relax taking pro- precautions at strong, as strong winds are still blowing and unsecured objects may be blown down, on no account should you touch electrical cables that have been blown loose. It's not yet safe for small craft and fishing vessels to leave typhoon shelters. At 4 o'clock, the center of Typhoon Ellen was near 21.2 degrees north, 113 degrees east. At the same time, a tropical depression has formed to the east of the Philippines and was centered near 11.6 degrees north, 127.2 degrees east and is forecast to move west-northwest at about 20 kilometers per hour across the Philippines. Area forecasts for the next 24 hours, Hong Kong east, force 6 to 7, becoming force 5 to 6 tomorrow, occasional squally showers at first, rough seas. Nana, Swabui, east to northeast, force 6 to 7, isolated squally showers at first, rough seas. South of Hong Kong, cyclonic up to force 12, becoming east to northeast, force 6 to 7 tomorrow. Occasional squally showers at first, phenomenal sea becoming very rough. St. John's west to southwest, force 8 to 9 in the south, but cyclonic up to 12 in the north. Frequent squally showers, high seas, but up to phenomenal seas in the north. The outlook for the following 24 hours, winds will remain generally strong. Latest reports from South China Coastal Weather Stations. Waglan Island, the wind east, force 7, with gusts to force 9. Visibility 8 kilometers in drizzle. The state of sea was rough. Tom, the typhoon, uh, the strong wind signal number 3, remains hoisted. At 7 p.m., Typhoon Ellen was centered about 190 kilometers southwest of Hong Kong and is forecast to move west at about 10 kilometers per hour towards western Guangdong. During the past few hours, Ellen has accelerated slightly and taken on a westerly track. It's now moving west at about 10 kilometers per hour. On its present track, it'll make landfall over western Guangdong tomorrow morning. And as Ellen continues to remain of typhoon intensity, local winds will remain strong overnight. Another surge of the northeast monsoon is also expected to reach the South China coastal areas tonight, keeping our winds fresh to uh, fresh to strong tomorrow. Stay tuned to commercial. We'll keep you further updated. Do not relax, it says here. Taking precautions as strong winds are still blowing and unsecured objects may be blown down. On no account should you touch electric cables that have been blown loose and it's not yet safe for small craft and fishing vessels to leave Typhoon shelters. If you're tracking at 7 p.m., the center of Typhoon Ellen was near 21.2 degrees north, 112.7 degrees east. At the same time, Tropical Depression Georgia on to the east of the Philippines was centered near 11.7 degrees north, 126.6 degrees east, and is forecast to move west-northwest at about 20 kilometers per hour across the Philippines. Typhoon Ellen has weakened into a severe tropical storm. At 9 p.m., it was centered about 210 kilometers southwest of Hong Kong and is forecast to move west at about 10 kilometers per hour towards Leizhou Peninsula. Although Ellen has weakened into a severe tropical storm, winds locally remain strong for quite some time. During the past hour, the mean wind at Maglin, Waglan Island was still 58 kilometers per hour and gusts of 104 kilometers per hour have been recorded at Tate's Cairn. Stay tuned to Commercial Radio for further weather broadcasts. You should not relax taking precautions as strong winds are still blowing and unsecured objects may be blown down. On no account should you touch electric cables that have been blown loose. It was 21.2 degrees north, 112.5 degrees east. PM severe tropical storm Ellen was centered about 250 kilometers southwest of Hong Kong and is forecast to move west at about 10 kilometers per hour towards Leizhou Peninsula. 
At the same time, a tropical depression to the east of the Philippines has intensified into a tropical storm named Georgia. At 11 p.m., this was centered about 560 kilometers east-southeast of Manila and is forecast to move west-northwest at about 20 kilometers. Well, now that Ellen is going, Georgia is on the way. Hmm. Maybe we'll play a song about that later on. Anyway, the weather forecast for tonight and tomorrow is for strong, gusty, easterly winds, cloudy to overcast with scattered, squally showers tonight, and showers will become less frequent tomorrow. The minimum temperature tonight will be about 23 degrees, the maximum tomorrow 26 degrees. At 11 o'clock, it was 25 degrees Celsius, the relative humidity 89%. At 11 p.m., the center of tropical storm Ellen was near 21 degrees north, 112.2 degrees east. A cyclone warning, which was issued at a quarter past five this morning by the Royal Observatory. A wake all night, the lads are. The strong wind signal number three is hoisted. This means that winds with mean speeds of 41 to 62 kilometers are expected. Severe tropical storm Ellen has weakened into a tropical storm, and at five o'clock this morning she was centered about 300 kilometers west-southwest of Hong Kong, and is forecast to move west at 10 kilometers per hour towards the Lejiao Peninsula. During the early morning, Ellen weakened further into a tropical storm and moved steadily westwards, further away from Hong Kong. On its current track and speed, Ellen will land near Lejiao Peninsula sometime this evening. Kong, and it's forecast to move west at 10 kilometers per hour towards Lejiao Peninsula. Local winds are still strong, and during the past hour, mean winds of 65 and 43 kilometers per hour were recorded at Waglan Island and Changchow, respectively, and gusts of 90 kilometers per hour were recorded at Tate's Can. During the early morning, Ellen weakened into a tropical storm and moved steadily westwards away from Hong Kong. On its present track, Ellen will make land landfall near Lejo Peninsula this evening. At the same time, an intense anti-cyclone over China is giving rise to a surge of northeast monsoon to the South China region. As Ellen continues to weaken and move further away, Hong Kong will come increasingly under the influence of this northeast monsoon, due to which local winds are likely to remain strong. If this is the case, the strong wind signal number three may be replaced by the strong monsoon signal later today. At 8 o'clock this morning, the center of Tropical Storm Ellen was near 21 degrees north, 111.3 degrees east. Lone strong wind signal number three was lowered and replaced by the strong monsoon signal, which means that we can expect these gusty, windy, wet conditions to continue. With information on Tropical Depression Ellen and Tropical Storm Georgia. At 10 o'clock, Tropical Depression Ellen was centered about 410 kilometers west-southwest of Hong Kong and is forecast to move west at about 15 kilometers per hour across the Lejo Peninsula. At the same time, Tropical Storm Georgia was centered about 420 kilometers east-southeast of Manila and is forecast to move west-northwest at about 15 kilometers per hour across the Philippines. At 10 a.m., the center of Ellen was near 21 degrees north and 110.5 degrees east and the center of Georgia was near 12.6 degrees north 124.4 degrees east Hilton, Hilton with information on tropical depression Ellen and tropical storm Georgia at noon tropical depression Ellen was centered over the east coast of Lezao Peninsula near Zian near Zanjiang and is forecast to move westward at about 15 kilometers per hour across the peninsula at the same time, Tropical Storm Georgia is moving from east to west across the central Philippines. With its center located at about 400 kilometers east-southeast of Manila, it is forecast to continue moving west-northwestward at a speed of about 15 kilometers per hour. On this course, it will enter the South China Sea by tomorrow. The forecast for this afternoon and tonight, strong gusty east to northeasterly winds, cloudy with bright periods in the afternoon. The outlook for the next couple of days becoming generally fine. At noon at the Royal Observatory, the air temperature was 25 degrees Celsius and the relative humidity 77%. A trace of rainfall was recorded at the Royal Observatory between midnight last night and midday today. At noon, the center of Ellen was near 21.1 degrees north and 110.5 degrees east. And that of Georgia was near 12.7 degrees north and 124 degrees Missed east. Missed on the weather. At 7 p.m., tropical storm sorry, Tropical Depression Ellen was centered over the Leiju Peninsula about 55 kilometers west of Zhangjiang and is forecast to continue to weaken and move west at about 10 kilometers per hour. 
At the same time, Tropical Storm Georgia was centered over the central Philippines about 190 kilometers south-southeast of Manila and is forecast to move west-northwest at about 25 kilometers per hour into the South China Sea. The South China coastal area is under the influence of a strong northeast monsoon. The forecast for tonight and tomorrow is for fresh, gusty, easterly winds, strong offshore. It will be cloudy with sunny periods during the day. The minimum temperature tonight will be about 24 degrees Celsius, the maximum tomorrow 28 degrees. At 7 p.m. at the Royal Observatory, the air temperature was 25 degrees Celsius, the relative humidity 78%. At 7 p.m., the center of tropical depression Ellen was near 21.1 degrees north, 109.9 degrees east. The center of tropical storm Georgia was near 13.1 degrees north, 121.7 degrees east.